Well, we are continuing to follow breaking news this morning, a shooting overnight in downtown Memphis. We have Sydney Gray there live at the scene, South Main and Gayoso, where police have been most of the morning. Good morning, Sydney. Hey, good morning. So police officers are beginning to clear the scene. Well, quite a few of them have left the scene. Uh, I heard those shots myself about 2.13 this morning. I heard a single shot, heard what sounded like yelling, and then moments later, two more shots, and then police were on scene, not even a minute later. And so police uh, did just provide us with some official information about 20 minutes ago. They tweeted that one man, one person, I should say, was shot and taken to Regional 1 in critical condition. We also know that one person has been detained at this time. Now, when I came down here, I was looking to see if there was anyone around and I saw one woman and she told me that she was around when all of this happened. Now, she tells me that it all the shooting rather stems from a fight that she says happened outside the bar near Blind Bear. She says young men were trying to get inside. It led to an argument with the bouncer, eventually a fight and then those gunshots. Now, there were a few people who came outside this morning shortly after police arrived, many of them concerned about what they just heard. This latest shooting comes as dozens of mayors from cities across the country came to Memphis to talk about ways to address crime in their respective cities. Now, Mayor Paul Young says while the national crime data may show decreases in overall crime, he says those stats simply don't matter if people do not feel safe. Now, y'all, it is quieter downtown, but still a bit of concern lingers in this area as police do wrap up that investigation. Again, looking here at this area, there is just two police cars still on scene. We just saw some emergency vehicles leave the scene just before this live shot started. But again, one person detained and one person in the hospital with critical injuries over at Regional 1. As we get anything new from police throughout the morning, we'll update you right here on Action News 5. Live here on South Main Street, Sydney Gray, back to you.